Battle of Beaver Dams was a very important battle in the War of 1812. It took place on June 24th, 1813, near present-day Thorold, Ontario. The War of 1812 started when Napoleon tried to conquer the world after Britain's army stopped the U.S.'s trade with France because Napoleon was ver- getting very annoying. Then the U.S. declared war with Britain because France was giving them a lot of valuable stuff by attacking Canada, a British colony. Laura Secord, the wife of a soldier who was wounded in the Battle of Queenston Heights and lived in Queenston, was forced to let some American officers stay in her home. She heard of them discussing their plans and quickly learned that they were sending Lieutenant Colonel Charles G. Borstler and his army from Fort George to destroy the post near Beaver Dams. Secor left her daughter to tend to her husband and set off into the night to warn Lieutenant James Fitzgibbon, a leader of the British Army, and was at that post of the attack. The journey was over 30 kilometers. When she got there, Fitzgibbon hesitated first but then believed her. Then they prepared for the fight. When the Americans got there in the middle of the night, they were taken off guard by 300 Kahnawaga warriors, 100 Mohawk warriors led by Captain William Kerr, and 50 British soldiers led by James Fitzgibbon. After three hours of terrible fighting in darkness, the Americans finally surrendered. The British left the battlefield with about 500 American prisoners, including wounded Lieutenant Colonel Charles G. Barstler. This battle weakened the Americans horribly and led them to later surrender fully. Over 100 years later, Laura Secord was finally acknowledged in the story and plaques were put up all around the area. The Battle of Beaver Dams was a very significant part of Canadian history and helped keep Canada strong. The End